guys, Camshaft here with a quick tutorial on PC-based Coinbase. Wow, that was a lot to say. Um, so I get a lot of questions on how Coinbase works, how do I get started, how do I get started trading cryptocurrencies. Uh, so today we're going to spend a little bit of time going over that. That will start right in. Um, so you're going to go to Coinbase.com as you can see up here. Don't forget to sign up. First name, last name, email. Choose a strong password. I highly recommend that. You don't want to get hacked or anything like that. State. Agree to the terms. Create that account. You will have a verification through your email. Make sure you do that as well. And at that point, you'll be able to sign in. So uh, you're going to put your email password. You're going to sign in. Now what I have done is I've actually set up a two-step verification. This just adds one extra layer of protection uh, for you when you're using the site. Um, I personally use Authy. You can use whatever you like. I will be going over that <clears throat> excuse me, in a later episode, so uh, we'll take a look at that later. Today we're just going to be going over the dashboard. Uh, so we're going to do dashboard first, and then I'll have a couple other episodes going over the other... Uh, fundamentals here throughout the Coinbase website. As you can see, there has been some report of uh, some errors in the credit and debit cards. No idea why, but that is letting you know that there. Um, so let's jump right in here. Price charts. As you can see, we are looking at Bitcoin right now. You have a one hour time frame. This tells you what's happened within the hour. One day, one week, month, year, and all. So you can see, you know, Bitcoin started at like, what, $13 here? And look at it now, 2,318. We passed that 2,000 mark. Wow, what a jump. So the other instruments here, uh, Ether, you have Litecoin um, on this side. So you can kind of see, this is basically going to tell you how your charts are looking. Next side here, you have your portfolio. You can see your total balance. And then you have, here's Bitcoin. I have 0 0.001 Bitcoin worth $1.86. Not that much because I trade on other platforms. Ethereum. Oh, looks like I have a penny. That's, that's kind of cool. Litecoin. And you have, also have your US dollar wallet, which is $2.17. Down at the left-hand bottom side, you're going to see your recent activity anytime you've sold or received any of these coins, Bitcoin, Ethereum, or Litecoin. I mean, you can kind of view a little bit further back by hitting on view your accounts there. Um, so that is just the tip of the iceberg here. Let's go back to portfolio. You can view all of your accounts. So you can see Bitcoin, Ether, Litecoin, USD wallet, and looks like you can do a vault as well. I haven't actually set that up going on you could see all the activity done within this Bitcoin wallet this right here was a free ten dollars bonus just for signing up and putting in a hundred dollars you'll find that right underneath your name invite friends I'm gonna put that link down below if you want to get ten dollars free just for signing up putting a hundred dollars in there I'm gonna give you this link down below I'll get ten dollars and you'll get ten dollars what a deal that being said, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this session up. We'll be going over the other tabs here, buy and sell, sell requests, accounts, tools, and settings later on. Thank you for uh, your time today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know what I've missed. And with that, you guys have a great day.